You know what this is? You've seen it before, may not be the same color, may not be the same size. It's a USB stick, a memory stick that you can plug into your computer. Now, the memory stick, not to be confused with Sony's memory stick, it's a piece of RAM or memory that you can connect to your PC or Mac by way of USB. And they come in a variety of capacities. But one thing that you've got to be careful about is removing this after you've inserted it without getting permission from your operating system. And this question was asked specifically by a community member, Kevin Cup, and you might remember we interviewed him a while ago. Uh, he's a, a student at Virginia Tech and uh, had called uh, not long at, well, the day of the shootings, we had uh, spoken with him. He used Ustream to communicate when he did an interview on national television. He was asking, should you really go through the process of clicking the icon in the system tray and officially removing that device from your system? And the answer is most definitely yes. Uh, Windows, in this case, sees this as a drive, an, an actual drive where you could read data from or write data to. And if it's in the process of writing or reading and you take it out, it's going to say, oh, it's in the middle of an operation. Oh. <laughs> Well, maybe it won't make that sound, but the next time you go to insert this particular USB stick into another computer or the same one, it may say, ah, uh, you know what, I don't know what's going on here, you want me to try to fix the errors, because I don't see nothing. Or what you had here isn't there anymore, and it's broken, because you got to keep in mind that if you didn't remove it before getting permission from your operating system, you may screw something up on this thing. Uh, it's also important to note that when files do get erased from these sticks, uh, they can be recovered with software. I've written about uh, a couple of titles before in my blog, and I'll be sure to link it off to the pages that we write up for this particular video. And as Datalore mentioned in the chat room, there uh, it's not just an undelete uh, utility, but a recovery utility. Um, the the uh, data lore in the chat room mentioned that these things have a shelf life. Much like floppy disks uh, can be volatile, uh, and, and CDs have a shelf life, and these things have a shelf life too. They're solid state, no moving parts, but data can only be written and read from this for so long before it says, <coughs> and that is a technical term. Uh, they've created a Wikipedia page for it, and uh, we're looking for editors for that page for the. <laughs> So, you know, just, just play by the rules, get the operating system's permission, I have really no other way of explaining what you need to do to step through before you remove a piece of removable media.